What's your boy Warlow back at a late night? Okay, the NBA playing is going on literally. Lakers won, the Pelicans and the Warriors or Kings are playing right now. I'm not sure which, but we are gonna go over the best way for y'all to do to Bill Russell. You just got home from work, you just popped on the game, and I'm gonna go over the best time construct away because a lot of y'all don't grind it right away. You might be looking the videos of how to do double doubles because that's the hardest one that people are struggling with and maybe you're spending way too much time than you really need to because it's a very time consuming one but i want to make sure to help y'all out so hit me so i help y'all out just hit that like button works both ways it's like a trade but yeah let's go to the agendas right now so the agendas right now are in seasons i already did it already is the dunks assists double doubles which a lot of y'all were struggling with which i will suggest literally for the double doubles do the double doubles do the Suns dunk and do the Hawks assist at the same time. Okay, so I'm going to show y'all like a lineup. But before I do, if you just want to double doubles easily and you just don't care about multitasking, well, then just come over to the Eclipse. You can just play Isaiah Thomas. Make your tallest center the point guard as an example. Like make Marcus Gasol and put like, okay, I mean, not do Marcus Gasol. Okay, so bonus would be 7-1. I just put Miles Turner, for example. Miles Turner, for example, put Darwin and put if you want to just do it the simple way, which this would be really, really easy, but you're not going to be multitasking. It would, I messed it up really. It's all, it's all good. Red ball. And you would start it up, and Isaiah Thomas would be on, you know, he would be right on Libra. Like, you can actually do it from this challenge if you want to. Like, you won't get any prizes, stuff of that nature. But you could just literally spam this challenge to grind your agendas if you wanted to do it this way because you can try to get the double-double, get the rebounds real quick on Isaiah Thomas. Well, Russ Reed was the shortest technically, but that's just another method. But I'm just going to show y'all the TTO way real quick, but yeah, that, that will work as well. So let's show y'all the TTO method. Okay, so we're going to go in. I'm trying to remember, make sure I had it in my notepad real quick. Let me open that in the background so i can remember because i'm gonna forget so i got a bad memory but okay so the hawks assist so for the hawks you don't really need a good hawks player like i mean i did it with a gold hawks player so just for the hawks like you don't need a good hawks player I'll, i use dimanche carroll but you don't really need a good one maybe like a hawks point guard yes he's patrick mills patrick mills he has a good release anyways double double since you're just starting off really the double double you can pick anybody you want to pick the suns player like i mentioned so deandre he's only like 5k on the auction house or player market excuse me there ain't no auction house ain't no ain't, ain't no auction house so we put a hawks assist double double and what was the last one maybe put another hawks player on there real quick let me do that yeah let's put another we'll just put another hawks player on there Personally, I prefer current gen really to doing these challenges, but y'all can do it on next gen. I think it's a lot easier on current, but it does work on next gen. So all you're gonna do really is DeAndre Aiden right there, left D pad, left D pad A, left D pad A. You can just hold LT, and it'll be a lot easier for y'all. A lot of y'all was semi pro, and for you're just gonna do this, literally do that and shoot it off. DeAndre Aiden will get a rebound. Look, we got one board. So do that again, LT, L1 if you're on PlayStation with DeAndre Aiden, hold him. Okay, DeAndre Aiden, I don't know what he's doing. DeAndre Aiden's walking weird. It's a little harder on next gen, but you get the point. You get the point. So Patrick Mills, again, let's try to get the 10. I want to get the 10 of rebounds real quick. Let's do it again. And look at that. I got, I got three boards already. Three boards with Patrick Mills and DeAndre Aiden. Really, really simple. Really, really easy. And right here, okay, let's try, okay, now that we got a couple rebounds, let's show y'all the Suns dunk. So instead of doing that, all you're going to do is hold LT, hold Y, double tap RB to make it cancel real quick, because, like, it's not going to let, okay, I, mean, I just got to shoot it off, <laughs> I had to just shoot it off. Like, that's how you make a R, that's how you make cancel R1 if you're on PlayStation, you got to double tap it quick. If you're on current and you don't got to double tap it. Because you can hold Y a lot longer than on that, but but yeah. So yeah, let's so do it. Should I look that re he just made that shot. Game is crazy. 
game is crazy though. Game is crazy. But all we're gonna do the same thing again. Okay, we got that. LT. Wait for DeAndre Aiden. Go back. And look at that. And he should get a dunk. Look at that one dunk. So we already got one dunk, four rebounds, and two points. And you want you can work on your five dunks at the same time. And like I said, the Isaiah Thomas challenge is really good. It's a lot easier. I personally think it's a lot easier for a lot of y'all. If you're just starting off, you don't really. It, it's gonna be, it, be, it goes up to 15 if it goes up to 15, but you're gonna get the rebound over Isaiah really easy. So that's only do that if you just want to worry about the double double and nothing else. Because you're gonna struggle getting anything else done since since it's the 15 points. But oh my goodness. Let me do that again. Okay, so we got okay, look at that. Perfect. Since we got the switch, right? Oh, like that's that's even more better. Cause I can just jack up any shot, and I, okay, I got blocked. I got I got sin packing, which is all which is all good, all good. So we got five boards, six rebounds. He can't shoot the ball really. Like I said, you can just keep going in TTO to get a favorable matchup. Come on, baby, come on, and look at that defense, bro. Did he just get the board back, man? Next gen's a weird game. Next gen is so weird, so 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 weird at times, but. Old LT, he's gonna get stuck again and dunk it. So we got two dunks, about to get a double double real quick. And basically, as I suggested, in the Mavs layup, since we're just mentioning it while playing, the Mavs layups, once you get all the dunks with the Sun players after five games, do the same thing for layups. Okay, with DeAndre Aiden. So I'm gonna show it to an eight. I'll just show the layups while we're here so we can just do. Remember, this will be, you wouldn't do this with a Sun player, but you can just use any Maverick player. And you and I, maybe I'll show it with the Maverick player because I'll just show it works with any Maverick player down there. They don't even have to be that good, really. So maybe I will show it a little bit. But DeAndre Aiden, again, I messed that up a little bit. I could have LT a little bit harder. I kind of screwed up. I could just get the rebound. But yeah, look at that. LT, boom. So we got five rebounds, six points, five is rebound. Like, it's just easy. And then on defense, just play your best defense. In all actuality, just play your best D and just literally you'll be done. So let's just get one more dunk. I'll come back to the end of it because y'all need to keep seeing it. So LT again, double tap RB real quick. Oh my goodness, I'm getting old T is getting tired. All good. All good. I mean, I'm not doing this particularly well, but it does not matter. We're good. Look at that and easy. But I'll be back at the end and then we'll review the Mavericks. The Maverick layups while we're at it. And how you can multitask with it. But I got it done really, really easy. Though on the method, we got 22 points, 10 rebounds, and 10, 11 assists. So we use two Hawks players. You can do it. You can get the assists with any of these players. So what you did in this is you did your son's dunks in one game. How many dunks? I got like way a lot of dunks in this game. I got like 10 dunks. You got 10 dunks. You got a double double. And you got an assist in one game. So you got three things done in one thing literally which is just so good so so good and see so we get a deluxe pack still can't find a playoff deluxe let me know you got one in the comment section as well if you get to this part of the video if you get if you get a deluxe pack really but next up we're gonna go to the mavericks you know while we're at it when we're here we'll go to the mavericks labs and same exact thing once you complete the sun's layup you can just use any Maverick player. So you don't really need that good of a Maverick player. Personally, really. Let's see. Maybe use Kyrie, Dante Exum. A lot of y'all don't have him. I'm trying to think of a player that's viable. I mean, I'll use Derek Lively. Like, no one that serious. Like, Derek Lively is going to be... I mean, I'm not, I'm not even going in with good players. I'm going in with gold cards. Like, you don't need good cards to win. It takes a little longer. If you have better players, you can just shoot threes, but... Like I said, you can just cheese the two-pointers and you can use cheap gold cards. It's just going just gonna to go a little bit slower for you. So what we're going to do the same method. LT. LT again. This time we're only going to go for a layup this time. Hold Y. Double tap. Hold Y. Just to press X this time. Don't dunk it. That's the only, That's the difference. Instead, now you're getting your double-doubles done. You're getting your Hawks assist done. And you're getting your layups done. It's a win-win deal. Like You're getting done three things at the same exact time. This is the money method in my opinion. I don't see a norm money method than this. So LT, do it again, hold Y, get him stuck, hit a layup, bucket. It's so easy. So easy if you're just starting out. 
And that's really all you have to do. You have to remember, double tap RB really fast or R1. I have to keep reminding that because then people are going to ask that in the comment section. You got to keep repeat, repeating it because people will forget. And I'm just going to throw it in there. Like I messed that up a little bit. I'm just using Derek lightly. Okay, come on, baby. Hold Y and buck. But yeah, that easy, really. We're going to go into the, we can go right into it because I'm pretty sure that showed it well. And the reason I got a second Hawks player just in case you get it, you know. And while you're at it, too, the next one is 21 points. And while you're at it, too, if you get done that, let's say you get done the Mavericks, you can now do the Nets points. If you get, you could do the Nets points technically if you want. Actually, no, it's going to be too tough. I don't know why I'm suggesting that. No, because you need Derek Lively points. So never mind. Act like I didn't say that. That doesn't work. That does not work unless you just, instead of doing Derek, instead of getting the layups, you worry about the Nets players. You can technically do that. I guess you technically you can do that, yeah. If you want, you can also use the Nets instead if, let's say, you wanted to use a Net player. But yeah, that's how you really do this real quick. So let's get into the next thing, basically, but we're almost done. And we got it done again, and look how many layups. We got 12 layups in that game, so that was really, really easy. Again, just get it done easy. So let's look at the Rockets. I feel like that's maybe the last but hardest one. For me, I end up multitasking the clutch time, like the Nets one, and that. I mean, oh, I got an iconic deluxe pack. I'll save that for a rainy day. But, like, I was combining these two. Like, I combined the uh, Nets points and the... Oh, what's the other one? The Nets points and the Rocket wins in clutch time offline. Because I feel like you can get them both done at the same time. Because you need three Amethyst and higher. Which, you're going to need a little MT to do it. Okay, but I feel like, you know, you grind everything else, you're going to be getting us some MT. And that will help you buy some of the players because you have to use three amethysts no matter what for the Rockets, which is annoying. And the Rockets, they even have any amethysts? Let's check. Okay. Any cheaper options like Singun? Okay, that's cheaper. So you're going to need at least for 50k MT, which like I, like I said, like I said, I feel like a lot of y'all have 50k at this point. And while you're grinding, you'll get some MT. So... I think y'all be fine with that, you know, you just gotta get them. And then you probably can just, like I said, you can even use the Y-Cut method for that too if you want to. If you're struggling making three-pointers, just use that method as well. And for, who got this card? Anthony Morrow. I think Anthony Morrow's a good one to get these points with. Anthony Morrow has a really smooth jumper. I feel like a lot of y'all have it. I, don't, I just don't know if everybody has it because he just... He was two seasons ago, but Anthony Morrow has such a clean jump shot to get to 21 points with. And he's like a cheap option if you don't have a good Nets player. You don't have a good Nets player, so Anthony Morrow. But like like I said, you can just use my earlier methods and not even use any good. And don't even need a good Nets player. Just as an example, you don't even need it, but you can shoot threes with Anthony Morrow. So yeah, all you can do is walk up, step back a little bit, step back to that free point line, and that should be Green Bay. I'm freaking gracious. Anthony Morrow, Great Banks. So I was struggling a little bit with this challenge to score, but eventually I figured out how to do it though, like really, really good. So I was just using the Anthony Morrow, and I was left D pad if you're on Xbox and just kick it out to him, and it's like a wide open free most of the time because the CPU just doesn't contest you right there which is really nice so remember left deep i don't know what that is on playstation someone might know someone will probably know but let's try it again as you can see i try to do that at him trying to get him in the corner again but i learned the pick and roll method was even better which i should have just knew that from the jump like the pick and roll worked every single time like lively locks him down gives a hard screen i messed it up a tad bit but it's all good i end up doing it again left right and getting another open three bang bang and we get one we just need one more three and i'll get a pick green water green beans easy money baby but i got 21 points with anthony morrow as you can see i didn't show the assist i got with the hawks player but we scored all the points for it really really you know a little hard doing it that way you can just use the y cut cheese if you want that way because it'd be easier but a little hard way, but it's it should be easy money. But yeah, I hope this helps y'all with this bold grind. I wish you luck on it. All this method should work. And for the 
for for this challenge just use the free throw challenge just real quick and the rebounds just jack up shots online you will get the rebounds i mean self-explanatory just hold y and you will get the boards thanks but yeah see y'all on the next of my team video Yee.